Developing tonight, we're learning more about the fallout from the retirement of Bob Lamy, the longtime voice of the Colts. Lamy said he made an inappropriate remark that was in a story he was retelling. News 8's Eric Feldman joins us now. We're hearing from Colts players now, Eric. Yeah, that's right, Brooke. We're going to get to that in a minute. We do also have statements from the Colts organization and Bob Lamy. The full ones are on our website, by the way, wishtv.com. Lamy said he apologized immediately after to the people around for that comment he made and hopes his mistake doesn't ruin his reputation in the sports community. Meanwhile, the Colts acknowledged that Lamy retired immediately after making that comment, adding the organization does not condone racial slurs used in any context. This news, it's still fresh. We wanted to get the takes of some Colts players today after practice. Lyman Anthony Costanzo had this to say. Uh, I mean, I, I've known Bob my entire career, and I, you know, I've had a lot of great interactions with him. Uh, but, you know, when you, have, when you have the horseshoe on, you're a member of the Colts, and uh, you're held to that standard. So Lamey retired on Sunday, and you may remember the initial Colts statement did not mention anything about the comment that Lamey made. It remains unclear if the Colts knew about it, but that statement did praise Lamey, saying, quote, he's as dear to us as anyone who's ever worn the horseshoe, end quote. Hear more from the players currently wearing the horseshoe tonight at 10. I'm Eric Feldman, Wish TV News 8.